Okay, that was annoying. I literally come back and the whole thing crash, and then OBS crashes again. I'm, I'm, all right. I, I was gonna go for a little bit longer, but I'm sorry, but this is really crossed the line. I gotta find out what the hell's going on with OBS. It should not be doing this much crashing like this. I'm sorry, but this is ridiculous. And let's see if we can go for at least an half an hour to an hour. Because I'm getting really angry with this. Alright, alright. Let's get back to it. Let's get back to it. So I at least... I I want to try to get at least... A little over two hours done. Not have these crashes keep happening and resetting the whole thing. Oh, this is giving me a headache and a half. Yeah, after climbing that mountain and beating that bird, we, we need a break. Alright. Yep. Back to Tuliola. Excuse me. <gasps> to the cabin. Do 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 do
the mart. She's way thinking. Can we actually go into the cabin this time? And not get mauled by something. Cutscene. Here we go. Oh, we definitely needed this though. You have a moment? What's up, Rook? Hook Lamotte, something on your mind? There's something I wanted to talk to you about. I'm all ears. So, I, uh... What did you do? Wook. What did you do? Uh, it's just too stuffy in here, that's what. We should go outside. Aye, a nice walk in the fresh air. That's what we need. Uh, you are really... You are trying to hide something bad. And it is not working, girl. Like, you are trying to get something off your chest. for some peace and quiet. Oh well. If it's to help, help her out, then it's fine. She's got a lot on her plate. Do -do 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 -do. Are you? Scene. Peshawar.
<laughs> yeah, I noticed. I noticed you were getting distracted. But it's fine. Do 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 do. All right. What's on your mind, Wuklamot? Ooh, the view from here is really nice. This is much better. I used to come here all the time when I was little. I'd look out over the whole city, and whatever worries I had would seem so small. Do you remember what I said at the top of Warcor Zormor? That I would fight to preserve Papa's peaceful Tural? Yeah. Well, I've been thinking a lot since then. About what peace really means. If it's just the absence of war. And it brought to mind all the best parts of our journey so far. I realize nothing gives me greater joy than the happiness of others. Life has its ups and downs, but the company of family and friends and the music of their laughter is what makes it worth living. And as silly as it might sound, I've come to believe that those smiling faces are the best measure of peace. That's the sort of thing I'd expect you to say. You've pretty much gone the other. Really? I feel proud somehow. It's an answer I arrived at by trying to be true to myself. That you think I succeeded. It means a lot. So. This is my plan. When I become Dawn Servant, I'll build on Papa's peace. Our people will live together in happiness. <laughs> it's just like Kryle said. By taking the time to hear their concerns, understand their feelings, and consider how best to serve, with each passing day, I'll be that much closer to becoming the leader I want to be. It's hard for me to say how much I've changed since the contest began, but there's one thing I can say with confidence. I wouldn't have come this far without you as allies. If it wasn't for you all listening and feeling and thinking along with me, I would have never learned so much, and in so short a time. There are two keystones left. After everything that's happened, and imagining what could happen, 
Are you still willing to walk this path with me? Like you even need to ask. <laughs> Thank the gods for that. Well, I have nothing else to get off my chest. I need to head to the palace, but I'll see you back at the cabins. Finally, some peace and quiet. We're able to get enough rest. Oh. Let's do this. Was complete. Peaceful intentions. Yas. They were a past and later the Brotherhood. Mamul Jot and Zab Zabral in the force of Yachtel. Oh, that should be fun.
Mamook. Yachtal. That's our next next destination. expression is like ah I don't know I can make that expression I love it I love it it's like he I would so make that expression oh that's gonna be so good the balloons cutscene <laughs> We know you're nervous. <laughs> yeah, of course, but hold your hand. Yeah, please don't. Please don't crush my hand. I kind of need it. Uh, oh, my blue. What's happening? Wait, what? They found out the origin of Kryle's earring? Yachtal. Still, at least, at least Kral's got a clue. This, this is getting really fun. Alright, so Yachtel, that's where we have to go next. Uh, 
Oh, hello. The fierce chaparral hunters who laid claim to this land call it the Azure Forest. Yachtel. Battered by meteors in ancient times and colored mesmerizing shades of blue and green by nature, it is easy to understand why the place is so named. It is here where the Chebral and Mamulja once battled for dominance that the right of succession would reach its climax. Yachtal. Are you all right? I've never been good with heights. The vegetation is far denser than in Kozumalka. I suggest you pay more attention to the ground, unless you want to walk straight into a cenote. A cenote? Sinkholes filled with rain and groundwater. Many meteors fell here long ago, it is said, and after they struck the earth, it became susceptible to erosion. Deep as some of the pits are, you'll not climb out in a hurry should you take a tumble. So, don't take a tumble. <laughs> <laughs> It was one time! Is the Chabral community depicted in the Lay of Repast close by? Aye. We need but follow the path a short way west. Right. I can't stand here with my knees knocking forever. Let's get going. Let's do this. Off we go. Now this place is dense. And wow. I was not expecting this at all. I have no idea what kind of fat rat that is. But at least we're almost there. No, the ether right coming up to tune to. Why is there one over here? Village of the Hunt. Cutscene. Nice. The voices, though. 
Nope. Huh. We got a warm welcome. That's unexpected. Wait, everyone? Hold on. That's a little ominous. Ah! graced by the presence of the third promise. If I'd known we'd be waiting on your mangy hive, I wouldn't have bothered with Ligarmanda in the first place. You self-serving piece of weaver dung! Do you have any idea how many could have been hurt? Now that we are assembled, let us begin. Hmm. My name is Hunmuruk. As Ibrash Rash, I have the honor of serving as elector on behalf of my people. As all four claimants must be present for this feat, we have eagerly awaited your arrival. Third promise, if you would please join us. Thus far, you have faced each other as rivals. The feet of repast, however, will test your cooperation. You must complete this challenge in teams of two. <laughs> what? You expect us to work with one of these weaklings? Be warned. Only the triumphant team will receive keystones. I advise you to cooperate with your partner. Teams will be decided by lots. Those who draw the same color will be paired accordingly. Twelve forbid Wuklamat is paired with Bakul Jaja. After all he's put her through, I wouldn't blame her if she did something rash. I might even help. Oh, love you, Alice. Eh? Clements, please present your colors. I have red. Blue. On separate teams, then. And the rest? Red. Which means... Together again. As fate would have it. <laughs> Victory's as good as ours. With our claimants thus paired, so too is their opposition. Oh boy. <laughs> this should be flawed. <sighs> Not the one hit.
Listen well, for the trial that awaits you is as follows. Each team is to prepare a sample of traditional Chebrol cuisine. Shibruk Pibil. <laughs> and now we must cook another ludicrous feat. Oh my goodness. I'm sorry, man. That is unexpected. <laughs> oh. Oh my goodness. That one was on... Well, that was on my bingo list of uh, things to do in Final Fantasy XIV, the new expansion. Oh my goodness. We, we gotta... We literally have to... Bro. Bro, it's like this was made for me. We cooking, I got the food truck ready. We got the kitchen on end. Oh my. Oh my, oh my, oh my. Dip. This would be hilarious. Like, I'm sorry, but what are the chances of uh, a human VTuber with a food truck doing a new expansion of a game, and you have to do cooking. Hmm. What are the odds of that? Hmm. Oh, it's amazing, I tell you what. I tell you what. Ah. Uh. Oh man. Anyway. All right, now then, let's uh, let, 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 let's get back to this. So it might seem, but there's bound to be deeper meaning to it. Agreed. Given that the very future of our nation is at stake, all parts of this right must have significance. Our promises have grown rather promising wouldn't you say? Indeed. If I were to guess at the significance of the feat, few things reflect the history and development of a culture so clearly as its culinary traditions. The variety of stewed dishes in Galian cuisine bespeaks their agricultural roots and cold climes, true. The peoples we've met on our journey, they've all had different practices involving food and drink. The Hanuhanu replenish their magical energies with reeds, while the Pelu Pelu have turned their fondness of beverages into a living. So basically, to know a people's cuisine is to know something of their ways. With each feat, we have deepened our familiarity with a given community's history and culture. Is this what Father intended for us all along? But a leader with his vision must see that the past doesn't hold the answers we need. It is through embracing innovation, not adhering to tradition, that we will usher Tuli Yolal onto a more prosperous future. The rules are simple. The first team to prepare and partake of satisfactory Shibruk Bivir will be deemed victorious. You will be judged by your sample's taste and appearance, as well as your adherence to appropriate cooking techniques. Kitchens have been made available for your use. 
Note that you may be asked to retry should your dish fail to pass muster. Let the feat of repast begin. <laughs> I've never actually heard of Shibrook Bibio before. It's a light, I wonder. This should be fun. <laughs> oh, Aaron Bell. Yeah, can't be overconfident, cause that'll that'll make things go boom right in the face. Ah, uh, some of the shenanigans. Gotta love it. <sighs> All right. Let's see now. It's a good thing I decided to go for a little bit longer than since uh, that crash happened. Okay, so that's a hint. I need to tune at the ether right wow. Yeah, they're up to no good again, which I'm honestly not surprised about. I should try going this way. I've gone down here. 
downtown baby don't you want to do 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 nothing down here but water what are you doing haha <laughs> I couldn't resist I had to so clue hunting huh Hello. A chote. Okay, so we found the third clue. Now where's that last of last clue? It's here somewhere, I know it is. Oh, it's on the other side. You've got friends on the other side. It's gotta be around here. Why is there a banana peel? Banana! Banana! I think we got enough clues. Now we wait. Day. Banana. Barack, without a doubt. Banana leaves. Way to go, Aaronville, and thank credit.
Uh, I'll take the, uh... I'll be on the team to gather ingredients. Gather some more ingredients. Yeah. Uh, okay. I had to move around some. I had to move around some. <sighs> I almost left without Wook Lamont. I'm almost out of a uh, inventory space. I, I gotta fix that. I gotta fix that. Inventory space has been my problem for most of this game. It's like, oh uh, yeah, I, I, I gotta, I gotta do something about that. Cutscene. Alright. Yeah, that's probably something we haven't learned about that dish yet. The old war.
ていう。All right. Looks like we know our next destination. Oh, whoa. Can't go that way. Actually, Mender, I need your assistance. Thank you. Yeah, I know, I keep messing with the map. Man, we really gotta go far. But it makes sense. Destination. I don't know what kind of fluffy raccoon you are, but dang. New place. Scene time. Okay. Hey, boo. Didn't expect him to be here. Repeat the reads. Give a minute, give a minute. Three, two, one. <laughs> the chicken promise. Oh. <laughs> uh. 
Oh my goodness. At least he's consistent. The Mughal Jaw wants people as much at war with themselves as they were with others. Huh. I kind of wish that they had some of these tales voiced, but then again, it makes sense. All right, so uh, here's what we're gonna do, folks. Here's what we're gonna do. It's okay. Since we had to wait for the uh, OBS to reconnect, it basically started the timer on the stream. But we've been going for a little over three hours now. And as much as I want to continue this, I, I need to get food in me. I have not eaten all day. So, we're going to end the stream here. So, thanks for watching, everyone. I hope you all had fun. If you enjoyed it, you're more than welcome to hit the fall and just subscribe button if you, if you want. All to you. And I shall see you all next time in the next stream. Till next time, this is Luminar, and I'm heading off. See you all later. Bye.